Well, today we have our Senior Technical Advisor from Bricks Communications, James Fitzpatrick, for our first Crisis Newsroom edition for 2017. So James, what will be one of the biggest challenges you see for Crisis Communications in 2017? Speed. In this day and age, if an incident occurs at your organisation, there's a bomb threat or an active aggressor at the front door or a severe weather event on the way, the most critical thing is to get a message out to all of your stakeholders as soon as possible. Your stakeholders in this day and age in 2017 will expect you to have the technology to be able to reach all of them immediately, whether that's through SMS, email, fire panels, whatever it is, they expect you to have that technology. So James, what are the consequences if you're not responding quickly? Someone else will fill the information vacuum that you leave behind and suddenly you've lost all control of the situation and the scenario that develops. If something goes seriously wrong at your organisation and you're brought before a court of law and they ask, how did you communicate with your stakeholders? And your response is, well, we sent an email out about 30 minutes in and we hoped that, that would get to as many staff as possible. Well, then you're going to have a lot more explaining to do. So James, what is the solution? Well, over the past six months, We've been working with a mass incident alerting tool called Ad Hoc from the States. Ad Hoc has been deployed at many large organisations in the US and around the world from the US Army and Air Force Homeland Security to big corporate organisations like Microsoft and Shell. They've also been deployed at many major universities and airports around the world. One of the great advantages of Ad Hoc is that it allows you to be able to communicate with all of your stakeholders, whoever they may be, immediately through a vast uh, array of mediums, whether that be through SMS, desktop apps, mobile apps, smart watches, uh, fire panels, whatever it is, there's pre-populated messages that you can pump out in a matter of seconds to all of your stakeholders. One of the other advantages is that it's two-way communications. So whatever message you send out, people can, your stakeholders can then send a message back, message received. In, under duress, I'm safe. Here's a photo or video from the scene or patch me into the conference call. In 2017, you must be able to communicate with all of your stakeholders immediately. They will expect nothing less, nor should they. If you'd like a demo of how ad hoc, ad hoc works or more information on how to communicate with your st stakeholders in an incident, reach out to us, send me an email at james at briggscommunications.com.au or comment in the video below.